One of the bedrocks of being prepared for the unexpected is having an emergency fund. Now, a general rule of thumb is it's a good idea to keep anywhere from three to six months worth of living expenses in an emergency fund. Um, now, whether you decide to keep three months or six months depends on a multitude of different factors. Think job stability, your, your debt situation, do you have a mortgage? And ultimately, you know, one thing I talk to a lot of people about, what's your comfort level? You know, if something were to happen, would you be comfortable with three months or six months? I know some people, they have very secure financial situations, but they're like, hey, I wanna have six months in cash. It's gonna help me sleep better at night. So if you're in the three to six month range in terms of the size of your emergency fund, you're doing really well. Now, the exact recommendation is gonna, like I said, it, it depends. And one thing that we work with folks on is how do we start building an emergency fund? Let's say that you're not quite at the three months. Well, how do we get there? How do we get to six months worth of um, savings. And what I'd say is two things. Number one, start small, but also number two, make sure you're consistent in your savings. We could start with maybe saving one or 2% of income, start with saving. Uh, another kind of common thought process I've seen is save half of every raise that you get. But the biggest thing is you have to be consistent. Save $100, $200, $300 a month, or even you know, $25, $50 to build up that emergency bucket. Now, the other question we'll get a lot is, okay, well, what, where, where is an emergency fund? What, what constitutes an emergency fund? And that really is kind of two places that we see, uh, number one, high yield savings accounts, as well as money market funds. These are places that have um, you know, pretty good interest rates at the moment, but they also uh, are places where the money's gonna be there when you need it. Um, and that's the most important part of an emergency fund is that the funds are gonna be there when you need it. And you don't know when you're gonna need it, so liquidity matters significantly as it relates to emergency.